Forex trading, also known as foreign exchange trading, is a popular way to invest in the global currency market. It involves buying and selling different currencies with the aim of making a profit from the fluctuations in exchange rates. The Forex market is the largest financial market in the world, with an average daily trading volume of over $5 trillion. A computer screen displays Forex charts and data. A hand moves a mouse to execute trades. The screen shows profits and losses. Forex trading works by exchanging one currency for another at an agreed-upon price. Traders can profit from the difference between the buying and selling price of a currency pair. For example, if a trader buys the US currency pair at 1.2000 and sells it at 1.2050, they would make a profit of 50 pips in page in point. Forex traders use various strategies and tools to analyze the market and make informed trading decisions. These include technical analysis, fundamental analysis, and risk management techniques. Understanding Forex trading, definition and overview. Forex trading, also known as foreign exchange trading, is the buying and selling of currencies in order to make a profit. It is the largest financial market in the world, with an average daily trading volume of over $5 trillion. trillion. Forex trading is conducted over the counter, meaning that it is not traded on a centralized exchange like the stock market. Currency pairs and quotes. In Forex trading, Currencies are always traded in pairs. The first currency in the pair is called the base currency, while the second currency is called the quote currency. The exchange rate between the two currencies is known as the quote. For example, in the Ahas currency pair, the euro is the base currency and the US dollar is the quote currency. Forex quotes are typically expressed in four decimal places. The last decimal place is known as a pip, which stands for percentage in point. For example, if the US currency pair is trading at 1.1234, a change to 1.1235 would represent a one pip movement. The forex market structure, the forex market is decentralized, meaning that there is no central exchange or clearing house. Instead, forex trading is conducted through a network of banks, brokers, and other financial institutions. These institutions act as market makers, buying and selling currencies at their own bid and ask prices. Forex trading is available 24 hours a day, five days a week, allowing traders to participate in the market at any time. The market is most active during the overlap of trading hours between the major financial centers such as London, New York, and Tokyo. Overall, Forex trading offers a high level of liquidity, flexibility, and accessibility to traders of all levels of experience. However, it is important to understand the risks involved and to develop a solid trading strategy before entering the market. The mechanics of Forex trading. How trades are executed. Forex trading involves buying and selling currencies in pairs. When a trader buys a currency pair, they are essentially buying the base currency and selling the quote currency. When they sell a currency pair, they are selling the base currency and buying the quote currency. Trades are executed through a broker who acts as an intermediary between the trader and the market. The broker provides the trader with a trading platform, which is a software application that allows them to access the market and execute trades. Traders can open and close positions at any time during the trading day, as the Forex market is open 24 hours a day, five days a week. The speed at which trades are executed depends on the liquidity of the market and the broker's execution speed. Analyzing market movements. Forex traders use various tools and techniques to analyze market movements and identify trading opportunities. Technical analysis involves studying charts and using indicators to identify trends and patterns in price movements. Fundamental analysis involves analyzing economic and political events that may affect the value of currencies. Traders also use risk management strategies to control their exposure to the market. These strategies may include setting stop-loss orders, which automatically close a position when a certain level of loss is reached, or using position sizing to limit the amount of capital at risk in each trade. Risk management strategies. Risk management is an essential part of Forex trading, as the market can be volatile and unpredictable. Traders must manage their risk carefully to avoid losing more than they can afford. 
One common risk management strategy is to use leverage, which allows traders to control a larger position with a smaller amount of capital. However, leverage can also increase the potential for losses, so traders must use it wisely. Another risk management strategy is to diversify the portfolio by trading multiple currency pairs and using different trading strategies. This can help to spread the risk and reduce the impact of any single trade on the overall portfolio. Overall, successful Forex trading requires a combination of technical and fundamental analysis, risk management strategies, and discipline. Traders must be patient, disciplined, and willing to learn from their mistakes in order to succeed in this dynamic and exciting market.